Today I want to talk to you about the quality of a BIS education and why I know our school is excellent. Firstly, BIS provides the highest quality education because we recruit the best and are committed to the continued development of our teachers. Let me introduce you to Alyssa Carter, who works at our secondary school, and to Ruth Buckley, who is an educational technology integrator. Alyssa runs a regular forum called Teachers Teaching Teachers. We have an amazing amount of talent on campus. We have teachers teaching in conferences all over the world. But I wanted to really capitalize on that and bring some of that diversity and strength back into BIS. In this session, we led a dialogue with teachers about artificial intelligence and how this is coming into play in the education sector as well as the outside world. What's exciting for me is that we can use these sessions reactively or proactively according to what themes are important in education at the time. We know that teachers in the classroom are the single most important factor in a student's success. That's why it's so important to me that we hire the best and the brightest and we never stop investing in their professional growth. Secondly, I know BIS offers the highest quality education because we provide students with a differentiated and personalized approach to learning. That means we meet each student where they currently are and support them to reach their own personal potential. One of the main problems that I had within my academic life was that I was unable to focus on tasks properly. And with that problem came a lot of struggle and a lot of failure and it got to my head until I was offered at the end of grade five by my teacher to join the learning support program. Learning support at BIS creates a welcoming learning environment that promotes academic success and addresses obstacles to learning. We work together with teachers, families, and external professionals in the BIS community to foster the healthy development of all students. This also has to do with our community value of inclusion and that access to learning is equitable. As I continued into my academic life with the learning support program, I started to notice that one of my skills in particular began to increase dramatically, which was my writing skills. And with this, I decided, hey, why not write my own book? BIS provides special programming for high-achieving, high-potential students with a variety of abilities. The Infinity program of the secondary school provides many opportunities for students to go deeper into subjects that excite them, while further developing their abilities and knowledge in a way that is appropriate to their learning speed. The Infinity program supported us a lot by giving us the perfect amount of time to work on our interests, to work on the things that we wanted to do, that we excelled at. Finally, I know a BIS education is excellent because we ensure that students are engaged and inspired by their learning. That means, as much as possible, they are making choices about their own learning. This provides students with agency, real-world application, as well as motivation. For younger students, this may look like inquiring into a topic of their choice and then choosing how to share their learning via text, video, podcast, or presentation. For older students, this could mean having choice in how they are assessed or how they gather information in the first place. It's a good question. It's a, it's a large language model. We're currently working on finding research questions about the Middle Ages, and we're doing that using a tool called ChatGPT. I'm really excited by the way that we now have to rethink a lot of the way we teach, because now we're actually, you know, we can, we can teach in really new and interesting ways, and we can also um, get our students to learn material in really interesting ways that weren't possible before. And I think that's just the beginning. So yeah, I'm really excited about it. Thanks for watching. I'm always open for feedback and see you next time.